Present perfect, perfect tenses of verbs. The present perfect tense is made up of has or have plus the past participle form of the verb. Has plus past participle form of the verb is used when the subject is singular. Examples A tourist guide has accompanied them since the first day a tourist guide has accompanied them since the first day of their tour. Sheila has worked as a nurse for a year now. Have plus past participle form of the verb is used when the subject is plural. It is also used when the subject is I or you. Examples, they have explored Igbaklag Cave for almost an hour. Sheila and Maricel have worked as nurses since 2015. In present perfect tense, we refer to an action or state that happened or occurred at an indefinite time in the past or something that began in the past and continued up to the present. With the present perfect tense, we also use the expressions for and since. For is used to express the duration of the action and since is used to indicate the starting point of the action. The present perfect is formed from the present tense of the verb have and the past participle of a verb. We use the present perfect for something that started in the past and continues in the present. Example, they have been married for nearly 50 years. She has lived in Liverpool all her life. When we are talking about our experiences up to the present, I've seen that film be examples. I've seen that film before. I've played the guitar ever since I was a teenager. He has written three books and he is working on another one. We often use the adverb ever to talk about experiences up to the present. Example, my last birthday was the worst day I have ever had. We use never for the negative form. Example, have you ever met, have you ever met George? Yes but I've never met his wife. For something that happened in the past, but is important in the present. Example, I can't get in the house. I've lost my keys. Teresa isn't at home. I think she has gone shopping. have been and have gone. We use have or has been or has been when someone has gone to a place and returned. Where have you been? I've just been out to the supermarket. Have you ever been to San Francisco? No, I've been to Los Angeles. No, but I have been to Los Angeles. But when someone has not returned, we use have or has gone. Where's Maria? I haven't seen her for weeks. She's gone for a week. She's gone to Paris for a week. She'll be back tomorrow.
the present perfect with time adverbials. We often use the present perfect with adverbials, which refer to the recent past. Here are the signal words. Recently, just, only just. Examples. Scientists have recently discovered, discovered a new breed of monkey. We have just got back. We have just got back from our holidays. Present perfect with time adverbials or adverbials which include the present. The signal words are so far, until now, up to now, ever in questions, yet in questions and negative. Examples. Have you ever seen a ghost? Where have you been up to now? Have you finished your homework yet? No. So far, I've only done my history. After a clause with the present perfect, we often to use we often use a clause with since to show when something started in the past. Examples. I've worked here since I left school. I've been watching that program every week since it started. We do not use the present perfect with adverbials which refer to a finished pastime. Signal words are yesterday, last week, when I was younger. Examples. I have seen that film yesterday. We have just bought a new car last week. When we were children, we have been to California. But we can use the present perfect with adverbials which refer to a time which is not yet finished. Have you seen Helen today? We bought we have bought a new car this week.